ever play like an actual famous musician fighting game? That would be awesome. Yeah. They kind of sort of did that with the uh, Def Jam. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that, the that's a, in for there. the hip hop genre. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. So why don't you make like a metal version of that? It only hits. <laughs> like Glenn Danzig only takes one hit. <laughs> yeah, that would get like their ultimate abilities would be like the uh, kids would be like the am I deep? Yes, I am. <laughs> Bruce Dickinson could just draw his fencing foil and cut your head off with it. <laughs> yeah. Now try this again. Uh, okay, sure. I'll try a different character. Thought I was gonna be, I was gonna be Dio, but it's me, this guy who is not Dio. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that doesn't look like a bubble. It looks like his shoulder pads or something. It does kind of. <laughs> Oh, and, oh, cool, there's another new game. Those are some evil freaking eyebrows, man. <laughs> In typical anime fashion, they go all the way past his hair. This guy has more conventionally named uh, fighting moves, I know. I mean, uh, move names. I, I would love it if one of them was a wrestler. That'd just be great. Well, in the full version, maybe there is. Yeah. Oh, throws! Okay. Oh, those, oh, those, those I honestly think any those. fighting That's... game where it's like, yeah, this person's a wrestler and is a viable fighter is awesome. I didn't realize there's actually Mostly multiple because... pages of stuff here. That <laughs> So you've gone back to the dawn of civilization. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Before the dawn of time, a race of druids. <laughs> no one knows who they were or what they were doing. Sounds like they're beginning the Highlanders. Oh, you never seen Spy This is Spinal Tap? <laughs> oh, yeah, that is what that's from, yeah. Oh, oh, oh no. We're in the way of that. Uh, okay, so I guess the stage gimmick for this one is that Ben Hur can just run you down. <laughs> oh, that was cool. Oh, no. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Uh, I I don't I didn't enjoy that getting hit, but it was good timing, I guess. Ow! Bubble cutter! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna do it? Oh. Huh, oh, getting some confidence. Good for you. Well, if you become powerful enough to kill a man with bubbles... Touche. You'd be, <laughs> you'd be feeling pretty good about yourself. I've done it with a bubble wand, but not bubbles themselves. <laughs> nah. Think, of, think how much it would suck if, like... Like, you know, you're, like you're, you're inducted into some, like, you know ancestral family martial art like they have in anime all the time, you know. And then it turns out it's like bubble magic. <laughs> I'd be like, fuck this. I don't know. <laughs> what a gem. That sounds pretty great to me. Raised you into bubble magic. So you're the rightful heir to <laughs> the tradition. <laughs> to the bubble magic dynasty. <laughs> and now you've got to, like, fight all these other guys with much deadlier martial arts to uphold the family. <laughs> you got the bubble magic guy and you have to fight the guy whose martial art, you know, 
turns his hands into living steel blades or whatever. We'll see in the context Your of- Your bubble magic is stronger! <laughs> <laughs> in the context of a universe that has other better magic, yeah, that would suck. If it was right now, and somebody told me I could do bubble magic, I'd be like, this is the most amazing thing <laughs> I've ever seen. <laughs> Fuck it, this works. <laughs> Wait, did the bubble cutters, did they ever actually hit him, or did they just, like, swirl around him until he fell over from fear? Yeah, I was wondering, I thought they were all gonna, like, like fly at him or something. That didn't happen. My spinning, saucer-like bubble cutter. That doesn't, calling it saucer-like doesn't make it sound scarier, dude. <laughs> Except for those horns, that's what my hair looked like a few weeks ago. <laughs> I didn't notice the horns. Before. Yeah, everybody called me Rod Stewart. I was like, yeah, whatever, that works. <laughs> Ooh, now the moon is red. You're getting an ass beating. Oh, oh, I wonder what causes that. 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 that, that oh, Ben Hur is on the move. Shit. Ow. Bubble launcher. Ha ha ha. Oh no. No. Ow. I want I, I like to imagine that this is all head because there's just there's like some scheduling confusion and like they ended up having the martial arts battle and the chariot race on the same day. <laughs> <laughs> it's just pure accident. That is poor event planning. <laughs> it's just a bureaucratic snafu. Maybe they're all just saying horrible things. <laughs> Oh, you know what I think it is? It's like the bubbles, they don't cut it. The bubbles are like, yeah, the bubbles are like lenses to like focus this giant rainbow death laser. Oh. So he's not even, the bubbles aren't cutting, the bubbles are using their, their optical. <laughs> that is the, I was going to say that is the lamest looking projectile ever, but it, it is working pretty well, so. Although it's not doing very much. Ow! Oh, 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 at least he got taken you to hell with me. Ow. Kinda looks like you're there. Ow, ow. Okay. Let's hit the old move list again. Um... One. Nick, Jade, if you have any tactical advice, I'm open. Um, do the thing. Mash more buttons. Crush the bra. <laughs> <laughs> Dig it. Hammond and Brett. Try spamming projectiles and then call it zoning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't forget to cancel uh, seven frames into the bubble cutter so you can <laughs> enact the second strain of the. Oh, he's got full. He's got full purple stuff. What? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Nicely side 
sides up that shirt. Aha! Uh -huh. And there you go. Retire. <laughs> How cool you can actually feel like the breakdown of the results. Nice. Average battle. Okay. Let's see. Who's next to die? Wamu. <laughs> Again with the blue lips. That yeah. seems to be a mo Who's to die. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's got spikes on his roof. Not him. Yeah. Hey, he's got different. Uh... Wait, is this a story mode battle or something? Oh yeah, so you're Caesar the Bubble. This, maybe this is my rival battle. This guy is actually seems a lot more fit to this setting. With like the sandals and the pharaoh outfit. Oh no! Can no one in this in the JoJo universe walk like a normal person? Nah. Ow! It's the bizarre adventure. Why should they do anything normal? Fair enough. <laughs> this guy looks like a Hawkeye initiative drawing come to life. <laughs> You're right. Ow! Ugh. Oh, he has a move. That move that apparently he was doing was go for the throat and lungs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ow. Oh, oh, that that throw is awesome. That was a long fight. Boot. Ow. Ow. Wamu. Wait. Did, wait. He just. It's, it's it's like how like when Johnny Cage does what is his flash kick? Where he goes Johnny Cage. Yeah. <laughs> Which move is that move? <laughs> Which move is does he say that for JT? Uh, Shadow Uppercut. Shadow Uppercut. I love Johnny Cage in that in, in that game. He's just such a douchebag. I can't wait for Cassie Cage. Oh yeah. How many how many characters have they revealed for the new Mortal Kombat? Uh, six or seven. Maybe eight. I watched those trailers the other day. Those are great. Yeah, I gotta start paying attention. Video. Yeah. I think that's the only video game site I have an account on is TRMK. <laughs> the realm of Mortal Kombat. Ow! Is it dot .com with a K? <laughs> that would be good. I think it's an org, though. <laughs> I screwed it up. <laughs> <laughs> This is like some bizarre dance routine or something. Oh, wow! It's kind of funny from my perspective. No! I'm it, sorry. Like, the video is a little jerky, so. So, <laughs> when this uh, guy, this Wamu guy, like, he'll get stuck in a pose for like a split second. <laughs> You're just as mesmerizing and fleeting as your bubbles. Ouch. <laughs> Well, okay, I think... I think we've proved a point. <laughs> Has your bizarre adventure come to an end? So, JT, you, you, you know fighting games better than me. What, what would you say? Um, I don't know, the controls are kind of... loose. It's one of those weird things where it's like... They, Get when good! They use, when they use 3D models for sometimes they... <laughs> it's like... They have to throw the whole punch before you can hit another button. It takes way too long to do anything. Okay. Nick, Nick, have you played this? 
I've played it a little bit. I tried it once. Uh, I, yeah, I agree with JT. It, it did feel a little loose. But I mean, that's a... I want to say it's a little bit of a nitpick. nitpick. It's stylistically very different from other fighting games, and I think That's it's true. competent enough, and it's worth it at it's least crazy. a look. It's it's definitely it's definitely not your run of the mill guy, who, you know, guy who's basically Ryu fighting fighting people at least. Jade, final comments. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's something. Your bubbles are just mesmer as mesmerizing and fleeting <laughs> as this game. <laughs> <laughs> well said. Well said. I came up with it myself. 